I've been at Harvard Medical School for 30 years. As Jeff said, I've been here at Mass General for 25 years. It's been great. It's been a great ride the whole time. I've been able to do anything scientifically, pursue any scientific question I wanted, and that's, it's just been uh, wonderful. And uh, with regard to this, uh, this particular prize for the work on telomeres, which was done quite a long time ago, um, I just want to say that it's really delightful to share that with Liz Blackburn and Carol Greider. So thank you. Thank you all for the opportunity to do this. The, when we started this, this work, we were really interested in a, a long-standing question about how cells take care of the ends of their DNA molecules. Uh, it, had been, it had been known for decades that there were, that there were problems associated with DNA ends. And uh, when I met uh, Liz Blackburn at a scientific conference in 1980, <coughs> Uh, we thought, you know, maybe we could do an interesting experiment by putting uh, telomeres that she had worked on, stable ends, from uh, Tetrahymena, a very distantly related organism, into the organism I worked on at the time, which was yeast. And the fact that that worked, that we could transplant these little pieces of DNA into yeast, showed that the, the machinery was highly conserved. It was, we thought, even at that time, it was probably conserved in all higher organisms. And so following that experiment, we learned a lot about how cells um, stabilize their ends, the enzyme telomerase, uh, and, and eventually its role in aging and cancer emerged from the work of many, many people over the years. Uh, and, and so what started off as work on a really basic question has turned out uh, you know, to our uh, pleasant surprise to have much broader implications. <laughs> you know, this is obviously this is the highest uh, scientific honor, right? So it's it's great to receive that kind of recognition. Uh, you know, I I have to say again that uh, it's it's great to share it with my collaborators and colleagues. Um, you know, a lot of the work was done by young students and postdocs in the lab who's creativity was you know, critical for, for this kind of work and you know, for all basic science. So uh, it's, just, it's great to receive and share the recognition. <laughs>